Okay, we have stopped the tram. Feel free to stand up, take as many pictures as you'd like. The airplane crash site set is a perfect example of a set that is all designed around the vision that Stephen had. When we first began to sit down to talk about the war of the world, I thought, what if the 747 goes down right in a big neighborhood? Because it's, it's just something you don't see. You're doing good. And if I could have everybody take their seats again, thank you. By the way, this airplane is a very real airplane that was taken apart and brought here and made to look as if it had crashed on this set. Robbie, get in. Get in. about different types of sets on our back lot, shells and facades, which we use for exterior filming. We also have practical sets. These have rooms inside and can be used for both interior as well as exterior filming. One of our practical sets is this cabin over here on the right. This is from the 1989 comedy, The Great Outdoors, starring the late, wonderful John Candy. Beyond the cabin, you'll see a big blue thing. That is the largest freestanding backdrop ever built. You have no idea how often you've seen it. It's usually used for distant horizons or far vistas. Although lately we've been using it as a giant blue screen for special effects. It was used for The Amazing Spider-Man, as well as by our friends from Disney for Pirates of the Caribbean 4 on Stranger Tides. The mermaid attack scene was filmed right here in front of this big blue thing. It was also used for the film Inception, but it was built for the film Jaws the Revenge. Now that's what it looked like in that movie. See, there it looked more like a distant horizon. We had a big lake right in front of it. Here's some other movies that have filmed in front of our backdrop. Now, one of the films I just showed you, or one of the scenes I just showed you, was from the film Van Helsing. That movie starred Hugh Jackman and was directed by Stephen Summers. Stephen Summers directed a big hit for us a number of years ago, The Mummy. In fact, just ahead of us is The Mummy's Tomb. I would love to take you through here, I really would. But we've been told uh, this is strictly off limits. Apparently too many, weird, too many weird things happened here during filming. So what we're going to do now is turn the tram around.